Hi guys, so I'm just about to leave to get my hair done. Um, this is what it looks like right now. It's quite like grown out as you can see. And here's my outfit. I just have this like tank top and I thrifted this skirt. Um, and then I have tights because it's a little bit chilly. And this jacket that I got from the men's section of Goodwill. Um, yeah, this jacket kind of reminds me of like yesterday I rewatched Sleepless in Seattle, like that type of style, you know, the, I guess that's 90s, I don't know, but I like it, I'll put this on. so obsessed with my hair like oh my gosh it's perfect and she cut little bits in the front yeah um my appointment was for 10 and right now it's 12 30 so it took two and a half hours i feel like i can just like take on the world now um 2023 is my year it's our year let's do it hmm Another thing, like whenever I ask any of my guy friends if I should dye my hair a fun color like pink or red or purple, whatever, they always say that I look better with like either my natural hair color or like light brown or something. But you know what? We don't like dress for men or dye our hair for men. So do what you want, live your life, we're all gonna die anyways, scare away the boys who, who would be scared by red hair because you don't want men who are scared by red hair. All right, I'm back home and I just kind of feel like adding some more sparkles on my eyes. I just got this like a couple days ago um, because I do like that whole like K-pop the eye look. And I was at like the Korean market, the California market um, in Koreatown with my mom recently. And there's like the atrium, I think like a Korean beauty store at the Korean market and I saw the glitters, so I got it. This is um, Sugar Twinkle and by Peri Pura? Peri Pura? I don't know. Um, and the color is just like number one. This is what it looks like, the box. So I already have a little bit under my eyes, but I never put any on the middle of my eye because I think I'm just gonna Add a little here. And here. Ah, why did that hurt? Um, I may have like gotten it in my eye. I don't know why my eye is watering. Um, anyways. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I could bring it up a little bit more. Since like my eye covers it, you know, when I look up, <laughs> it just goes away. So it should be up here. Okay, I added a little bit more in the corners too. I don't know if that's actually how you're supposed to do it, um, but I like it. Guys, I am hungry. I'm gonna go make some lunch. Come with me. <laughs> oh, the closet's open. Why? I don't really feel like pasta right now, but I need to show you guys what I got at the Korean market with my mom. Guys, it's Hello Kitty pasta. Do you see how cute? They're little bows and little Hello Kitties, and I am obsessed. Like, when I tell you, when I saw that for the first time, my heart like stopped. I literally like, oh my gosh. Um, yeah, if you don't know this about me, I um, was obsessed with Hello Kitty, and there's definitely a little part of me that still is very much obsessed with Hello Kitty, but um, like in elementary school, my first email account was huanghellokitty at gmail.com um, and I had like a million Hello Kitty stuffed animals. It was a problem. Um, but anyways, 
this. I love it. Okay, it is time for Trader Joe's vegetable gyoza. Um, I love these. They're so good, especially steamed. Um, so I'm gonna get the steamer out. Steamer is out, and I'm just gonna take the pieces off, put the water in, Whee! and then close that up. Cool. Okay, I did just prop you guys up on a vitamin bottle and a candle. Innovation. Um, let's go ahead and put these into here now. How many do I want? make five. That sounds good. Okay. Now we wait. How cute. It's just simple, but yum. I'm excited. Okay. <laughs> Guys, just get the eye sparkles. Do it. That's so fun. It's totally on my eyelash. It's so fun though. Like, I feel so fancy. Y'all, maybe I just want to be America's singer. Like, I have been rereading these books and the red hair, the fiery personality. Like, who would not want to be her? Oh my goodness, my mom says that I'm too old for these books because I'm approaching 21, like turning 21 this um, month. But I believe they are a classic read um, for any age, kind of like Harry Potter, except with princesses and, um, you know, all the tea. It's so, it's so good. It's so good.